guys, it's coming up to the end of exams. I was obsessed with looking at university videos and I'm currently in the University of Aberystwyth, not Aberystwyth um, and there was no videos at all. There was no room tours, there was no Q&As and it was oh, a little bit. Um, so I thought I'd just put some videos together. The videos would mainly be based on you and me. So yeah, um, a little bit about me. I started at Aberystwyth University in September 2015. I'm coming up to finish my first year, which is really scary, studying psychology, which is so good. Like if you're considering coming to you and do psychology, um, the staff are lovely. The resources are so I definitely recommend coming to see it at least before you decide. So my first video is going to be a Q&A. Um, I'm currently on an Aberystwyth Fresher page and I asked to like join their little first year group of questions they wanted to know, which were basically the same questions that I wanted to know when I was on university. So the first lot of questions were what to bring. Um, obviously I'm not going to name everything you need to bring to university, but first thing that I probably did was if you've got Pinterest, I'm just popping on Pinterest like um, university parking list and they'll give you a list when it comes to stuff you don't need because that was another question someone was just a bit tight on money and um, she was asking what can she buy on a budget I would personally like a lot of people go to Ikea to get all their stuff if you like me like Ikea was a few hours away so I couldn't just drive well get my parents to drive me there um, Wilkinson's if you've got a Wilkinson's near you Literally, I would just go there and I think I probably spent like no more than 80 90 quid. They give you packs of like a multi pack of pans, you can get trays. Kitchenware is the best in Wilkinson's. I say that I have burned like a hole in all of my pans because I can't cook. Some people are asking me what's the best hall to move into if you haven't decided already. <laughs> I'm currently living in Rossa F. All of the Rossa blocks are the same. Some right now, like I'm in an unrefurbished one, but I think by the time everyone comes in September, all the Rossa blocks are going to be refurbished. So like maybe in my next video, I'll show you like the refurbished and non-refurbished one, which I don't think there's much of a difference. Like I just enjoy having an ensuite and they've both got the exact same ensuites. So it doesn't really bother me that much. Okay, I'm playing Gleis, which is the new block. So a lot of people are probably going to try to get into it. I'm not going to lie, they are really nice. If you were like me and you knew that you wouldn't really be able to afford it, then I'd say Rossa would be the next option. Especially if you want your own little ensuite, which I do like having. <laughs> it means the difference of not doing like the naked leap across the hall to go to the shower. You can just, just jump in. Mine's just So yeah, in my room door I'll show you that. I've seen a lot of like questions about like town. I need to go to the door because the postman's doing my makeup. Yes, I just bought a makeup bag and they give me sweets in my makeup bag. <laughs> where to go in town. Um, I think everyone's been hearing stories there's nowhere to go and they're gonna have a shit night out and that is not true. <laughs> like one of the best nights out that I've been on. <laughs> just because of peer pressure. Peer pressure. So I'll give you the tour of where I go. I'll start off pre-drinking in the flat until I um, off my tits. And then will I go? Yeah. And then I'll probably go to I don't know. Where will I go? I don't know. <laughs> if I was going on a social, we'd go Harry's Academy Beachins. Um and then we'd either go Yorko's or Pia. No, I prefer Pia. Yorko's is just not for me. But a lot of people would say the other way around. They really don't like Pia and they like Yorko's. So it all depends how you feel. So yeah, up to you to make your mind up. Just come here and out. The university does sell at fresher bands for the events. I think it's £45 I paid or to any of the union events. Um, for free. I think there was like one or two of them wasn't included. Most of them were. Um, I personally didn't go to any of the events for just stupid, stupid reasons. 
stupid, stupid, stupid reasons, which I regret. But I drag my go to them. Like I made a lot of friends anyway. But if you're the type of person that might be a little bit shy and you don't make friends that easily because you know, just quite quiet, I would recommend getting it because you do meet a lot of people. They've got phone parties, paint parties, beer colour. A lot of people enjoy beer colour. <laughs> So like I said, I'm living in Rosreff. I live with, but at the start of the term, I was living with eight people. One, and let me just count it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. Um, and in my block, there was three boys and five girls. Yeah. But. That changed because one of the girls I was living with, Dodo Yumi, and then... I don't know. Yeah, but obviously now it's June, no it's not me. <laughs> um, one of the boys has moved out, so... That's sad. But yeah, I was quite fortunate. I was quite fortunate to live with my flat. Um, I know a few people that are full. No, I know a few people um, that didn't like live with their flat and they ended up moving. But no, my flat was lovely and I'm living with them next year. I'm moving back into Rosa. It's just more convenient and I probably wouldn't walk up the hill every day for lectures. Onto the hill. Penglise Hill. Will defeat you. You can try and tackle Penglise Hill if you want. Good luck. Taxis, you I recommend you doing as soon as you get your obviously packing, packing stuff. preferably before you start your lectures go up Constitutional Hill. I think that's what it's called. I don't know. I can't stuff. Um, go up Constitutional Hill. Um, me and my boyfriend <laughs> we decided to walk up it, but there is like a train that goes up for three pound. But on a super nice day, it's 100% worth just going up there and just... I took a little picnic from Tesco, so... Yeah. Um. Things I recommend you trying also is some of the food places here. Now, I didn't know about this place until the second semester when my friend and his boyfriend took me. Fusion King. Fusion King. Oh. Damn. Mm. It's so good. You can have like a box, like a quite big box, and they do half rice, half chips, and you can have like two toppings. So I normally have crispy chicken and I think it's called like succulent pulled pork, and it's so good. Does this treat them as well? Another question that I had off one of the people on the Fresh Group chat was do you have to move your stuff out over Easter and Christmas? And the answer to that is no. No, no, no. No, I just left all my stuff here. Like, I was only home. I... Did I go home for Easter? I think I was at least home from... I can't remember. I was here for two weeks over Easter because I went to Liverpool and back home for a week needed to be back <laughs> and add it to our stress. But yeah, you can leave your stuff here and it's safe because you've got your key, don't lose your key. If you ever find anyone that I've lived with this year and you mention the word key, um, I always lost my key. And by lost, I don't mean like I didn't know where it was. I just like wouldn't take it with me 10 o'clock in the morning and be ringing the bell again. It's so annoying and I probably bug the hell out of them. So if there's one piece of advice is buy something you can connect. So like I've got one of those like pink faux ball, like pom pom balls. I bought a lanyard. It's not Figari, but yeah, just make sure where you take it with you. <laughs> So that's all the things that I can think of to mention in this video. I didn't want to go into depth because I want to make like specific videos on it. If you want me to do any like specific video, 
so like maybe a QA or a room tour like in the next video um just give me a message on facebook if like you know me if not just like leave it in the comments below so yeah just leave it in the comments below and i'll try and get back i'm planning to do uh, like do another video over the weekend so it'll be up every monday like that's when i plan to put up all my videos so when i do start back in september um, i'll still be able to do videos regularly so i'll be able to edit and stuff over the weekend so yeah uh thank you for watching and i will see you on monday hopefully